The Fresno Teachers Association is demanding change from the Fresno Unified School District. Video released by the FTA shows a teacher who uses a wheelchair crawling up the stairs to get on a bus. The union is calling this incident a, quote, humiliating ordeal. Thanks for joining us tonight for Action News. Good evening, I'm Warren Armstrong. And I'm Margo Kim. Tonight, the district responds to that video. Fresno Unified is calling what happened deeply troubling and unacceptable. Action News reporter Anna Torreya is live for us right now at the district office where she's been digging into this story. Anna. Hey, good evening. It's a very hard video to watch. The Fresno Unified School District now investigating the district, also looking at, as to when those bus requests were put in. But the Fresno Teachers Association says that this is about human decency. Are you okay with me, JC? On Friday, the Fresno Teachers Association released this video on Facebook. You can see Ayer Elementary teacher Jackie Escavel, who uses a wheelchair, crawl up the stairs of a school bus as students were heading to the Fresno Police Department for a field trip. You can see what looks like towels on the steps as Escavel drags herself up to her seat. It was just an educator that was frustrated and uh, wanting to do the best for her students to go on a field trip but then also to bring attention and awareness. When FTA President Manuel Bonilla saw the video, he says his stomach dropped. He adds that no one should be treated like this. In a statement, Jackie Escavel said, quote, I am tired of being treated as less than by the district. It's not just about me. It's about ensuring that all educators with disabilities are treated with the respect and dignity they deserve. One of the reasons why I believe she wanted to uh, get these images out is because just being tired or treated uh, in an inhumane way. The FTA says an inclusion bus should have been made available to Esquivel. She had also been in communication with her um, um, site leadership and then the uh, district uh, transportation department in order to verify in the weeks and days leading up to ensure that this bus would be available. Fresno Unified is investigating the incident and Superintendent Bob Nelson issued a formal apology video on Thursday. On Friday, Action News spoke to Nelson after the release of the video showing Esquivel crawling onto the bus. It's egregious not to be able to provide the things that people need in order to do their baseline functions of their jobs. We are actually reaching out to statewide advocacy organizations in order to help us with that training piece. People asked, are you just going to train bus drivers? I think that's an insufficient response. I think everybody in our system needs to understand what the implications are. The FTA is calling for the district to increase the availability of inclusion buses, provide comprehensive training on ADA policies for all bus drivers, and put accountability measures in place. The district says it'll also be looking at its own infrastructure, from transportation to buildings, to make sure it's ADA compliant. And moreover, that we just treat people with the dignity and respect that are due them just as humans in our sphere. Now, the FTA applauds Esquivel for having the courage to speak out on this. The district says that they did reach out to Esquivel. Reporting live from downtown Fresno, Anna Torreya, ABC 30 Action News.